Hello everybody and welcome back to Dyson Sphere program Rise of the Dark Fog. Let's kick things off today by fixing a very um, imminent issue that I'm gonna have. And that is we're depleting the fuel reserves that we have here quite fast. So what I'm gonna do next is... I will actually um, double the production or quadruple the production, I guess. I'm going to scale up the production of this. Yes, that was the word I was looking for. Scale up. Much better. And lack of item. Of course, you have lack of item. So let's get a few more of these. And I will get this. I'm actually, uh, actually gonna change, uh, gonna change this si slightly. There's still a bit of proliferation happening there, but this has eight veins. This has six veins is a full belt and the way I'm gonna hmm. yeah I don't like that I'm crossing the uh, line here because the layout is gonna change so Okay, these are six machines, I like it. Nice. Okay, this grid doesn't allow me to squeeze items in between. But that's okay. So, you're gonna go all the way here. And come down like this. Then we're gonna have this one going like this. And I should be. No, I don't think I have a bab. Come on. Just like the one that I actually needed to be there. Okay, I need to copy it like this. And. Let's pause time for a second here. I do want to change um, the order here just slightly. I will want to get these ones quite fast still. But I want to get my personal upgrades which are substantially cheaper. First, yeah, this was the one. Okay, Q is full. I'll let this run. Some of the technologies are going to be slightly cheaper, so that's going to be good. So this one has six veins, this one has eight veins. I can set up proliferation based on uh, this pipe here, or belt.
Let's see, I will leave an empty space over here for particles. And let's see, I actually want to set pl uh, proliferation on the. I don't need these. Let's get rid of all the coal in my inventory. Let's get this one like this. Let's get the proliferator. I should definitely have one in my inventory. Oh no, I don't have one in my inventory because I didn't pick it up. Have signal towers which is really awesome i'm gonna try to make use of that fairly soon so we'll have our proliferation line going through there i still have a chest okay i want to get a chest i want to well, let's add some items here and I do want to get all of this okay that's good let's do it like this and For now, I'll just I'll just do something ugly like this, and I do want to get all the fuel proliferated beforehand before it gets into the storage chest. And let's see, we'll have another line starting here, going all the way here. I think that this is going to be the correct space. This needs to be upgraded and actually use three to get everything out. That's misaligned. That's better. And that's an 8 as well, so I can just do okay, that was the wrong wrong line. Just expand this to over here. Um, this belt is actually going to, going to be fully consumed, so I need to. I would need to do it before the merger happens. That's why I am going to change this to here. Okay, I can get it out, that's great. And I want this.
Yeah, that looks a bit better. I could pick up everything. I don't want to get rid of stuff though. There's two in here that don't have proliferation, but um, actually, do want to get that as well. Let's redo all of that. any on me so I'll just use another inserter to backfill the line over here that's for my max personal use Everything in here seems to be producing at full speed. How's my power doing? My power is... Not great. Could have been better. Okay, we have that one. Logistics. Six is very nice. Okay, I do want to change something here. Back of item. Okay, that's much better. Let me dump thing in here. I wanted the line to come uh, from the same place because it makes the setup of pr uh, proliferation so much uh, neater. But yeah, that being said, let's move over to this area. Uh, there's still some stone in left in this area, so... There's also some a stone vein over there if I need to get more. And that should see my that should uh, see my uh, fuel supplies uh, filling, not uh, emptying. Uh, this this one is empty now. We're up to. 500 and everything is working and we are slowly growing the number of uh, units that we have in there so that is really great and right I have just noticed one tiny detail here. 
We're already barely producing this, let's not make it any harder. I think that this is basically enough. And what I want to do here is, well, glass first. That's the only thing I can do out of stone that I'm not already manufacturing. But I'll actually convert the glass into prisms straight from here. Glass is required in a few recipes, but right now the more stringent bit and the thing that I want to get on the bus is the plasma exciter. Let's go ahead and get this going, get uh, prisms on the bus. And I am thinking to slightly change the way the bus is... meant to be working but uh, I'll get back to that in just a second I want to focus on finishing this build here and I want to look at the ratios again so this is gonna produce half a belt so three per second and this consumes three at two seconds. And this is done in an assembler. So if I was to use two assemblers, now I know that the basic assemblers have a speed factor of 0 0.75, but like three would be too many. So I'll, I'll just keep it to two. This will give me uh, so from three per second. This will give me two per second, and I guess I'll have to I'll have to work with that. I forgot to set the recipe in here. And I will just, uh, well, first of all, I need more of these. Oh, I'm out of gears. That can be very easily resolved. Get rid of some of the junk in my inventory. And the thing is, I'll never actually... I don't ever think that I'll require glass per se. Or most of the recipes for glass that I'm gonna use are gonna be actually prisms. Or more advanced uh, derivatives of prisms. I hope. So this should be consuming most of this. It will pile up, so if I actually need glass, I'll actually have a bit of surplus there. But there we have it, we have prisms, and I will take this on the main boss. Of item. Let's take this and I will go over here. 
Where do I have an... I think I have an empty lane like this. So let's go here and on this lane. That's silicon. I can switch it up from the get go. And yeah, this is an empty lane. So let's go all the way over here. Let's put the next thing on the do list. And that is going to be this thing plasma exciters, which is copper coils. Um, Magnetic coils. Where do I have magnetic coil stored? It's over on this line. I need this one and it's actually this one first and then this one. over here and let's go one level up let's bring this one and this one I do have two babs helping out with work over here finally we have more inventory space We'll have a couple of technologies queued. I don't care about that one that much, but let's see, this is already queued. I don't care about energy shield right now. I think that these are the rockets, explosive, so. Very nice one to have. Uh, I don't remember from the top of my head all the requirements for this. So yeah, there are mostly there are there are a couple of technologies that I can do there, but most of them are still locked. More movement speed, I'll actually take it. And another construction drone that's actually very good. I didn't expect, I thought this column is all yellows, but there are a few that aren't, it seems. And I'll actually do this one over here. Now, full disclosure, I need to I still need to think about um, how exactly I want to do this. But the way I'm thinking about this right now is like this is going to be ever expanding and I will need to eventually do more like items like uh, sorters, arc smelters, etc and that's gonna turn into a quite a huge mess i'm thinking that the products that are derived here just to store them in the space i've left right here and let them use these little guys to carry them around and i do have quite a few processors so i can build quite a few of them and just looking at it, um, I'll still use splitters. For some reason, just using belts and not having to use uh, sorters, fields, 
just a bit better to me. I'm not saying it is better, it just feels better. Well, I'll speed that one up, I won't... Uh, I won't be able to keep up. Oh, actually, I need... If I remember the recipe correctly, I that should be the correct move. Let me see, where is this one? Two seconds, consumes four, so that's two per second. I don't think the regular one can insert two per second. Okay, so we have automated a few of these. I'll actually steal Kill some of this. Let's get all of this into my inventory. I got rid of some of the other stuff. Now this is a bit tragic because it's fully utilized. So I, but I don't know if I need them for anything else right now other than um, actual raw recipes. It's fine, it's gonna be fine. So this one is working. I have a bit of junk in there, but that's okay. How is power holding up? Power is at limit, so I'll just add another row. I need to get some foundation. How much do I have? It's almost 3k foundation. And let's start queuing up. some of these wait what all of them I'm gonna need plenty Okay, I did use all of the plasma exciters. I will need to create some of these guys. Now I don't want to build engines. I do have plenty of engines here. one's going and let's get over here and expand finally expand my um, power think that we need to put it like this yeah that's good Be over here Why? Why can't I drag? So we have cruise right now, so we could theoretically go on to other planets and see what's happening there. But I still, I think we still have plenty of things left on uh, this planet. I will have to monitor how this is gonna progress. 
We're at two stacks and 30. Let's, uh, let's check this back in a while. I did produce glass here, but I totally forgot about it. That's a bit silly of me. Let's make this a distributor. Provide and collect from Icarus. And do I have any drones? I did not requeue up the drones after I cancelled them, so let's up a few of the drones so let's get a few more of those and now I can build Okay, that's full. I will look at the others uh, just a bit later. Now, I think it's... Uh, well, the threat here is not all that great, uh, but I do want to finish uh, reclaiming this planet and uh, well, getting rid of, the, of this base. It is a Fairly small base, nothing too much to worry about, but... Uh, let's see, the way this is going to work is... We're gonna use a combination of missile turrets and... Uh, where are they? Did I craft any of them? No, I haven't. So it's missile turrets and this one's signal towers. And for signal towers, I actually need crystal silicon, which is made out of silicon, which I have not much. So let's go ahead and I'll actually repurpose that uh, that lane over there, which I haven't used. And basically you start making silicon instead of glass. At the very end here, I'll have another one. That is going to be producing high purity silicon. Almost out of sorters. So I'll need to fix that fairly soon now I could have went straight into a box but um, oof, this is too, too much glass what's happening here oh these are these ones are stacking up a bit so it's gonna take a while to fully saturate that's good that's not a problem I'll get rid of some of the glass that I have extra on me and I can also get rid of some of the actually I won't get rid of the silicon will however get rid of some of the things I won't be using anymore and I 
think that was a replicator that's needed. To produce... Isn't a replicator? Um... Did I not unlock that technology yet? I will let the time pass. So this is the titanium crystal. What I do want is the it's called the silicon crystal or something along those lines. I was quite sure I have already unlocked, but uh, Not proliferator is not this one. This one. I actually did not unlock. This will allow me to get diamonds and crystal silicon. So Let the research just run for now. We are researching at a decent pace. Is Red Tech. So we're researching just with two labs because Red Tech is. It is producing at full speed. No, it's not producing at full speed and it's not producing at full speed because these ones are too slow. Which means that these ones weren't working at full speed, but it's okay. We're gonna be fine. Now, let's look at where I can find a nice strip of land, preferably very close to our ammo depot. This is a nice strip of land, there's actually quite a bit of land here. There we have a huge ocean which I do not want to fill. So let's go ahead and actually use this area. We can fit quite a few of these it will actually defend my outer base here as well which is nice oh, belt wise i can probably squeeze the belt over through here on this side and of item should be able to craft some of these Steel. Steel is not that big of an issue. Let's see how I can get the belt. So I can get the belt from over there and get the belt over like this. Yeah, I guess that's what I'm gonna do. Let's see. Or through here and through here and then what? Right with what object 
Okay, let's squiggle it a bit. Okay, not colliding with anything now, I hope. Get this one over all the way there. Let's put down some foundation. Yeah, that will have the effect. I want that there and there. I will go with our poles like this. I think this should still power. Okay, let's go all the way to, to here. I think that this planet is friendly enough to uh, not require more than uh, two rows of these. Can I squeeze a sorter over here? Kinda doubt it. Uh, not a sorter, but a splitter. Oh. Is that belt still going? Them. Okay, I need more of these. I need to get some engines, I need to get some steel. Steel, we have plenty over here. Engines, plenty over here. I just want to free up a bit of inventory space right now. Place hats on this because I am going to use all of these eventually. And maybe on some of these gears I'll definitely need. Okay, lack of item. Cleared up my inventory a bit. am I running out of engines I have okay, I'm running out of these ones of which I have plenty okay. fly back all the way over here On that line, let's make sure that I align them. And that we have a line going all the way to here. I actually need to offer 
lap, so build this. They're all powered. Ammo should be delivered fairly soon. And I'm getting more of these. Get ammo going. And I do want to Yeah, these technologies, but um, I want to prioritize the crystal smelting because we will need those. Um, what are they called? Signal towers. So basically, signal towers work at as range extenders for the missile turrets. So it kind of doesn't matter where on the planet we have the missile turrets, but as long as we put one of these signal towers down we will get a very wide range. Uh, well, all the laser turrets anywhere on the planet will have act, uh, will be able to shoot in that area, which is a bit OP if you ask me, but... Um, I'm definitely not complaining. one is going at full speed let's see how this one is doing this one is actually stacking up which is really nice that means that if need be I can actually okay that was a bit scary I was it did look like I was uh, consuming at almost full capacity Threat is slightly going up as well. So. Oh, the prisms are already full. I don't want to get rid of the glass, all the glass in my inventory. So, I'll just, or almost all the glass, I don't want to get rid of everything. I'll, ju I'll just keep one stack. One stack should be more than enough. I am happy with this. And that being said, um, I think we're at a good point to make a cut in this episode. Now, I'm quite happy with the progress that we've made. We have a very nice... Uh, we finally have some defenses over here, which is really great. In the next episode, I think that we'll have the capacity to go and... Uh, take care of the threat present on this planet and um, once that's done we can definitely go and look at next planets but until then i hope you've enjoyed this episode thank you all very much for watching and i'll see you here next time